Добрый день, мы в Токерии Такус номер один на новом фудмаркете «Вокруг света» на Никольской улице в Москве. И мы сюда пришли, чтобы снять Хорхи Ваеха, шеф мексиканского ресторана «Квинтаниль» в Мехико. 22 место в мире, но тем не менее, вот такой умудренный, амбициозный повар не постеснялся приехать в Москву, чтобы помочь Владимиру Мухину сделать простейший мексиканский стритфуд «Тако». For me, more than a more than a preparation is a way of eating. I think the make the the way of eating the taco is very universal mm -hmm. because you have something which is in this case a, the tortilla, and you can put almost anything or okay. everything mm -hmm. in the in the tortilla. It can be chicken, seafood, uh, pork, beef, vegetables. So it's more the way of eating. What is this a taco? Okay. People always ask me how many different kinds of taco exist in Mexico and I can say how many Millions. preparations you can yes. make <laughs> no? because you can put anything mm -hmm. inside of a taco. I think almost every civilization has this own version of taco, like for instance India they have roti, the Chinese they have the, you know, the roll yes. with the seaweed mm -hmm. which is very very I mean it's not the same but it's the same the same, princ the same principles mm -hmm. of eating in Mexico we have the tortilla We have different kinds of tortilla. For instance, this is a tortilla out of a uh, flour, mostly eaten in the northern part of the country. But in the southern, the southern part of the country, you have the corn tortilla, mm -hmm. which is very different. In this case, we decided to do it here for the taqueria with flour tortilla because it's much more easy to get the ingredients. Okay. So we decided to do three different kinds of taco for, for this taqueria which is one of the northern part of the country, one of the center part of the country, and one of the southern mm -hmm. part of the country. Taco Pastor is the taco from the center part of the country. Like 70 years ago, when the Lebanese people came to Mexico, mm -hmm. they bring, like, in anywhere they took the, the kebab, uh -huh. to almost everywhere in the world. In Mexico, we change the recipe, and we mix it with chiles, pork, we use it the same technique Uh -huh. grilling it. And what about pineapple? The pineapple is to give the freshness. The uh -huh. Usually you put in the taco salsa or vegetables uh -huh. on the top to give a special flavor into uh -huh. the preparation. In this case, taco al pastor, literally translated, is shepherd taco. Shepherd, mm -hmm. you know the shepherds? It's a mix with uh, different spices, achiote, which is a, a seed from Mexico. Mm -hmm. You have chili, guajillo, coriander seeds, cilantro, leaves, mm -hmm. onions, garlic, cinnamon, all mm -hmm. mixed, mm -hmm. then blended with the uh, vinegar, and then you marinate the meat, and you grill it, you know, uh -huh. like the way a kebab. And then you cut the meat and uh, you pineapple. You the meat, you see it's oh, nice, with nice grill, have all the, all the caramelization of the beef, and then you also have the pineapple at the end to give this freshness, okay. frutal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm flavor into the taco. Okay. This is the, 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 the meat, uh -huh. already shaded and chopped it very, uh -huh. very finely. And then we have a special a variety of uh, taco al pastor, uh -huh. which we call it gringa. Gringa? Gringo. <laughs> Americans. Yeah, I, I don't know why, honestly. Uh -huh. But usually what you do, you put the cheese. Okay. Is it mozzarella or something like this? It's regular, yeah. Ah, regular, yeah. okay. You put the you put the tortilla. Uh -huh. Like this. And then you usually put Some cilantro. Uh -huh. In Mexico, we put also lime. Uh -huh. This is the taco yeah. al pastor. And that's all. Yes. Yes. Just lime juice. Yes, squeeze. What a guy, Mexican shawarma, taco al pastor. Gringa. Gringo version. And the very good shawarma, Maria. And always put next taco. Is the taco perron. Perron means very nice or literally translation means dog but also dog is 
Перро, собака. Какая собака? Просто инженерал. This can be with or without cheese. Mm -hmm. I prefer with cheese. Okay. This is a taco called perron, as I'm saying. Okay? So, you have your finely... Mm -hmm. Minced beef. Minced beef. In this case, it's a triple, as we said. Perron. Perron. Taco Perron. Always. Yeah. Guacamole. Guacamole. Mm -hmm. Salsa. Pico. Thank you. Это это дичайшая, я так подозреваю, вкусная говяжья шаурма мексиканская с неплойным guacamole и сальси. Такая валютная, да? Еще мешается холод и, и, и жар. Очень вкусно. И главное, дико много вкусов. Лайк? Угу. Next. Окей. Okay. We call it black note or black taste. It's all different spices and chiles burnt, like totally mm -hmm. burnt for gastronomy. To burn something, an ingredient, it's considered like not good at all. Oh yes. But in Mexico, it's the best way to develop a different flavor. So this is all out of burnt ingredients. How is this called in uh, Espanol? Recado negro. Recado means note or message. Jaune pismo это называется. Black is negro. Ну чер черное черное письмо. So this is a uh, chicken with the spices. This is from the south. This is not cheese. And what kind of spices? This is a, a chile called uh, chile país, which means chile of the country. Because mm -hmm. in this part of this of the of the of my country, they consider this area mm -hmm. a different country. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is the chile of the country. Of the Yucatan, okay. it's garlic, onion, black pepper, a chiote, a seed from the area, a special seed. Sure name it. And this only with onions. Mm -hmm. Onions like with some some chili and yeah, it's only squeezed lime uh -huh. and chili. Thank you. Третий вид так, как вы поняли уже, что нельзя класть в черную метку, допустим, гуакамоле. Просто потому, что в той, в той части страны, где я делаю черную метку, не любят гуакамоле. Вот это мне нравится, когда шеф умеет делать шаурму, а не разные молекулярные штуки. Не только разные молекулярные штуки. Такой очень насыщенный вкус. Никаких угольков. А такой прям был. Под речком таким. Перец, прям. Да, перец играет, но как бы и нету вот этой остроты сумасшедшей, но вкус очень интересный дает. Такой праздник, праздник во рту, хоть он и черный. Black, Black Celebration, так пела группа Depeche Mode. С вами были мы и Хорки Ваеха. Замечательный мастер Тако. И не только. Очень вкусно, мать, попробуй.